The markets opened up slightly today. It comes after stocks plunged yesterday with investors concerned about tensions in Ukraine and slowdowns in China's economy. Well, some more questions about General Motors' massive car recall. The car maker acknowledges it knew about a defective ignition that led to as many as 12 deaths. But now a consumer watchdog group says that between 2003 and 2012, 303 people died in accidents in GM's Chevy Cobalts and Saturn Ions when airbags failed to deploy. GM says the new report is based on raw data without rigorous analysis. Well, BP can once again drill for oil and gas in the Gulf of Mexico for the U.S. government. The company reached an agreement with the EPA yesterday that allows it to bid for new contracts. In November 2012, BP pled guilty to charges surrounding the deadly oil spill. Part of the deal calls for an independent auditor to monitor the company for the next five years. And it's been 30 years since the first handheld cell phone went on sale. Back in 1984, the phone was so big, its creators nicknamed it the brick. The Motorola phone cost nearly $4,000 and lasted about a half an hour before the battery died. That's your CBS Money Watch report. For more, follow me on Twitter at Jill Wagner CBS. At the New York Stock Exchange, I'm Jill Wagner.